Right, Mark, we were here this time last year at the last league game of the season. Here we are again, late on a Saturday evening. Last year, I think, if I remember correctly, the first thing you said was sort of apologise for the team's performance. Yeah. But very different today. Yeah, last year it wasn't great, was it? It was a bit of a down sort of end of the season, but this year, obviously, we got a win and it's a great way to end the season. Um, we made hard work of it, didn't we? Um, well, 4-2 perhaps, is reasonably convincing. Yeah, but 3-2, it was getting quite nervy. They had a lot yeah. of free kicks, didn't they? A lot of, uh, a lot of pressure on us, but we got the result, and that's the main thing. And, of course, here you are in tracksuit while everyone else is in the shower. Your enforced holiday. Any complaints? No, no, I was sending off, I know it was a red card. It wasn't any intent in there, I wasn't trying to hurt the no. ladder or anything. Was, no, no. My eyes are out, I was looking at the ball. I just didn't anticipate quite how close he was to me as, a, as the ball dropped. But. And uh, Gary said on interview, I think, and at the forum the other night, that he had no complaints about the red card, but he also said that, which we all know, that it's not like you no, to uh, mistime a tackle like that, shall we say? No, that's my, uh, that's my first sending off I've ever had in my life. Is it really? Yeah. I've never been sent off before in my career, but... Yeah. So you've, you've missed two games and obviously it's the three game suspension. So what's the position with Wednesday? Apparently I can't play in that either. It's during my suspended period. Even though it doesn't count? Even though it doesn't count, yeah. I don't quite understand that rule, but no, I can't right. play in either. So it's a four game ban. Effectively, yes. Yeah. So uh, you'll be missing for the first game of the season. Yeah. Any idea whether that's likely to be Woking's first game? Uh, I have no idea. Gaffer's not, no. Really, uh, not really spoke to us yet, so... Sure, OK. What's going on. Thoughts on the season as a whole? Uh, very successful, I think. I think we started off slow. Um, I think the gaffer was still trying to sort of assemble some some personnel. Um, once we got the team together, we uh, we really took off and thought we'd done really well. So um, it's been a good season. And any particular highlights for you? You can't you can't point to a goal, unfortunately. Uh, shot? Uh, <laughs> no. Luton was probably a big highlight. That was a great game. Um, that was a really good performance. It was a felt like a really good win um, there's been lots of positives throughout the year I and mean, some of the results we've got some of the places we've gone and got results Barnet Gateshead um, we've got some really good wins it's been, uh, it's been very enjoyable well, which would you say was the, the best performance of the season I have my personal view what, what's yours best performance yeah um, single best team performance wow uh, Barnet I thought we played really well yeah we played really well at Barnet um, that was a good day out terrific atmosphere there as well yeah it was uh, Mine was Gateshead. Gateshead, yeah. I thought that was that superb was very good, because yeah. they very were in controlled. bang in form then. Yeah, we played. We, played we had a good game plan in that game. We uh, we set off at times, let them have it a little bit. We kept our shape, and the whole team worked hard. And the structure was good. Yeah, and Johnny Goddard got. Did he get one goal or two? I can't remember. But I can't remember, uh, yeah. he, he's sort of emerged from nowhere as far as working sports are concerned. The second half of the season. Yeah. done really well for us he's been absolutely fantastic he's just he's grown he's got better and better as the season's gone on um, and he's a, he's a fantastic talent yeah I know you guys are all aware of him because he was training pre-season and so on and so forth but he seemed to as I say appear from nowhere as far as we were concerned yeah he just he, he just seems to just go on leaps and bounds as the, season, like I say, as the season's gone on it's, uh, it's been great he's a really good lad as well yeah um, back to today female referee here today have you ever played in a game with a female referee I think so yeah I think it's in a couple yeah. of times not many I was trying to remember the last time we had one for a working game we've had lines women or assistant referees I can't remember a, a, a female referee since Wendy Toms and that's really going back no like you say there's been a few linesmen there um, yeah. I can't think of anyone else but I'm sure I've had a, a woman referee again before is there any different sort of mindset amongst the players when they know it's a female referee no, I don't think so no. no exactly the same good good to hear that <laughs> That's how it should be. Yeah. And uh, finally, this time last year, you were a new dad, and now your little girl's just over a year old. I yeah. was, you had her at the club the other day, didn't you? So yeah. All cool, still good there. All brilliant. Yeah. Family it's life, wonderful. Amazing. Yeah. Loving every minute of it. Brilliant. Thanks very much for all you've done this season, Mark. Hope to see you again next year. Cheers, Dave. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Cheers.